what's good what's up youtube how y'all doing this your boy aj of the deep thought back at it again once again ha <laughs> ha what's up y'all how y'all doing man yes sir we back at it with a brand new video man today man i want to talk about adam 22 and why you know he looking like a whole clown out here on the internet man as as y'all don't know y'all should know if you don't know adam 22 you know he a well-known podcaster you know all that type of stuff no jumper podcast all that as you know him and his now wife lena the plug have been doing only fans content for about seven years they've been together for about seven years you know what i'm saying as you know he a self-proclaimed adult entertainer as well him and his wife now wife lena the plug have been doing content on on the only fans for about a good seven years you know what I'm saying? since they've been together all right and now you know what i'm saying that they just got married not too long ago they got married recently and now she decides to do adult content outside of doing it with her husband adam 22 you know what i'm saying she posted a video of herself and another man and i guess they did some adult content shout out to the poor man's podcast for the video you know what i'm saying he got the video you know what i'm saying shout out to him i'm gonna leave his links down in the description below let's get into it guys guess who i'm shooting with today <laughs> it's finally happening wow i did not know you were gonna do that <laughs> Come on now, dog. Come on, man. Now, I had to block out some of her body because in the video, she was essentially wearing a loincloth. But this is what Adam had to say about the situation. I just want to break it to you guys so that you guys all know what's going on. <laughs> After seven years together, we've been doing porn pretty much the whole time, but we've gotten more and more deeper into the conversation or into the, the porn stuff. Mm -hmm. And after, you know, many hundreds and hundreds of threesomes and stuff. Yeah. I decided, well, we decided. We met. Oh, uh, yeah. Everything that I do and use is under the act of the fur use. So, you know, like I said before, shout out to the poor man's podcast. You know what I'm saying? He talks about the situation. <clears throat> you know, I'm not going to show the I'm not going to show the video itself. I'm only going to show audio. I'm only going to play the audio. You know what I'm saying? And I'm going to give you my take on the whole situation. Let's get it. I've been having this conversation for like damn near a year. Okay. She shot her first ever scene without you. with another man. <laughs> Oh, over the weekend that shows growth <laughs> that shows growth, yes. bro but they get on your ass saying that you you don't have it in in you to disagree with me so i'm gonna use this as an example tell me how you really feel what about her do listen <laughs> for the money you don't want to hear what i'm talking about for the money young. I, I'm <laughs> now i'm gonna go back so y'all can hear what adam 22 said i let y'all see this part of the video you know what i'm saying because it's important to understand where we're going with this. You know. And we finna understand why Adam 22 is going out like a real life buster right now. So let's check it out. We decided. We've been having this conversation for like damn near a year. Okay. She shot her first ever scene without you with another man oh over the weekend that shows growth <laughs> that shows growth yes. bro but they get on your ass saying that you you don't have it in in you to disagree with me so i'm going to use this as an example tell me how you really feel what about her do listen <laughs> for the money you don't want to hear what i'm talking about for the money young. I, i'm gonna tell <laughs> for the money young, Stop, yeah i disagree i could disagree with adam if he told a lie like you, you try to stay away from bullshit on the podcast mm. it's like all right how i really feel 
is that I need my girl to go out and shoot a motherfucking porno solo scene so she can bring that bag back home. This is a business, nigga. Mm-hmm. Uh, y'all smoking crack! Facts. Something is wrong with you people! Facts. Lucy Sharp's face where Adam breaks the news. And the dude in the green is a perfect example of what happens when you worship money. Your friend is telling you about a situation that he probably regrets to some degree or he wouldn't have brought it up to you and all you can do is co-sign it by saying at least he's gonna make money? If any of my friends were willing to stoop that low just to make a little money, I wouldn't even be able to trust him because your loyalty can probably be bought. All Facts. I'm trying to say is I have a better chance of getting a tan from a light bulb than somebody has to convince me me to let my wife do something like this for money hey, this is business to me Facts. it was kind of like the reality is is that her career has been you know helped by me for sure but also held back by me to a certain extent because of the fact that we would only shoot together and it's like a man to realize that shit. the, the yeah, number one real. thing that she gets asked that she gets requested whatever is they want to see her shoot with another guy and you know we've kind of had the conversation over the years and and i started to come to this realization that the reason why I didn't want her to do it was not because of my own personal jealousy or anything like that. It was really just the fact that I didn't want to be the guy who got roasted on the internet that week. You know, I and that's where the mistake happens. It's okay to want to protect your reputation. You're not insecure if you don't want your wife to not do certain things because you could be publicly humiliated. You know, I didn't want to be the one that everybody yeah, was making feedback. videos about whatever. Well, too late for that, Goofy. You done already did it, so now you're getting roasted. <laughs> too late for that one. <laughs> it's too late for that one, goddammit. You're already getting roasted on the internet for what you're doing. So, <laughs> it's too late for that one. Let's continue with the video. And I slowly started to feel like that's kind of a stupid reason for me to hold her back from doing something that would realistically be very very good for her career you know right. congratulations you played yourself Facts. yeah but it's horrible for your career and i know with a budget blank smart home collection you can program your i apologize for that let's get back into it some people in the comments are gonna be like oh well he did it why can't she do it let's just be completely honest it hit different it's not the same and you can tell it's really affecting him because this isn't the first time he's brought it up but so i've been with my girl for mm -hmm. seven years facts and that's the thing he know that he know that shit fucking with his mental he know that shit messing with him he can act like it don't but he know it do that's why adam 22 is a goofy this is the person y'all push online. This is the influencer that everybody wanted to do an interview with. Really? Really? This is the same dude that did a whole interview with a well-known neo-Nazi white supremacist. You feel what I'm saying? Now... Since he, I guess his girlfriend, I mean his wife, I'm sorry. His wife got tired of the game bangs with him and others. Now she want to do it outside of him. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, man. I ain't going to make this a long video, man. Like I said, Adam22, he a duck for, he a cluckster, he a lame-o. You know what I'm saying? Again, it's day life. I don't really give a damn either way, either or, you know. But when you put this shit on the internet, best believe we going to talk about you. Like, ain't no ifs, ands, or buts about it. We're going to talk about you. And that's something you're going to have to live with, man. Let's check out this clip where he tells Crip Mac and the, and the other crew about the whole situation between him and his wife. Just got married. Mm -hmm. We're not in an open relationship, but had to say this, sir. Y'all not in an open relationship, but y'all doing open relationship type of things. This is stuff you do if you in an open relationship, or y'all in like a like some type of polygamy relationship. If y'all not in an open relationship, why are you doing it in the first place? I understand y'all adult content creators. Y'all was doing it together. Now y'all want to, huh? I don't get it, man. I just don't get it. 
from a porn perspective, we shoot with other girls, stuff like that, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. But no other guys. Well, you guessed it. Over the weekend. Oh, no. Something like that happened. She filmed her first ever scene with another man. I know oh, you was mad. Shit. You I was mean, angry. I, I agreed to it, so I wasn't. But, I, but, I say but, angry but, might not be the word. But you was kind of like disappointed a little bit. Like, <sighs> you five like cut, like cut out. Now, you heard what Crip Mac just said. Now, I understand. I know Crip Mac always get, you know, that people love to talk about Crip Mac. But sometimes Crip Mac can say some stuff that make you think sometimes. So let's go back and listen to what he told um, Adam 22. Let's check this out. Angry but, might not be the word. But you was kind of like disappointed a little bit. Like, you <sighs> five like cut, like cut. That's your sitch. You know, I agree to it. She gave me a lot of outs on the way in. Like, yeah. she kind of kept telling me, like, if you don't want me to, I won't do it. You, you should know? have said no. I, I, I said that I wanted you her to do it. I'm like, on top of millions of dollars, Adam. You didn't have to do that shit. Fair enough. This is how a real friend is supposed to react because if the thought is bothering him now, wait till he sees the video. And there's more. Facts. Facts. And we talking about Crip Matt that said this. We ain't talking about no ordinary person. You know, he big Crip. And he, you know what I'm saying, tell it like a T.I. is. It's affecting him. Best believe it's affecting him. It's affecting him in more ways than one. It really is. He can say that it ain't, but it's affecting him. It, it is. It's, it's affecting him. It's messing him up in some type of way, form, shape, or fashion. I don't care what no one thinks. I don't care how no one feels. I'm going to get deep into the video, and then I'm going to get my final takes on it. Let's go. More in this video, but give me a second because I want to make the main point for why I covered this topic. This is why it's good in your relationship or in your life to have hard lines in the sand. Things that you are not willing to do or things that you're not willing to allow. Because when you don't have those boundaries in place, it's easy to allow something or do something that might cause you a lifetime of regret. Thanks. And I'm not here to tell you where your line should be. For some men, the line is I'm not going to allow her to go to the club without me. For Adam, his line was I don't want her to shoot a scene with another man. Don't come compromise your line in the sand because in the example of going to the club if she goes out to that club and something happens you're gonna feel guilty to some degree because you knew you shouldn't even allowed it to happen in the Facts. first place but i, I told her Facts. i'm like i think you should do it let's let's get it All out right, the way so how, how do you five about it now she's 32 do I need to get you an old english no <laughs> yeah i don't, I don't need right. to drown the pain in okay. the old english uh, but i was kind of surprised because i feel like i can like intellectualize it and from my perspective I don't think it should be a big deal, yeah. but then after she actually did it, I'm not going to lie, I did feel kind of odd. You oh, know? Maybe. Of course you did. Of course you felt odd. Because, again, it was an agreement you and your wife had made. You would never do scenes outside your marriage or whatever. She decided she wanted to do something outside. You agreed to it because that's your wife. You didn't agree to it because you, you wanted her to do it. You agreed to it because she your wife. You, you see what I'm saying? So, yeah, it's going to affect you. It's going to mess you up. <laughs> and I, for one, really don't feel bad at all. I, I really don't care. I mean, in my eyes, you ain't nothing but a... Um, you ain't nothing but a culture vulture anyway, so I don't really give a damn. <laughs> I don't care. You know, but hey, different strokes for different folks, I guess. Let's continue with it. Well, a little bit of that feeling in, in the belly, See, you know? Well, well, like, God damn, God black? like, fire real? Yeah. God like, God oh, damn, man. like, yo. Look, I don't know if she convinced him to allow her to do it by using the old, why do you care what other people think? You're insecure if you don't allow me to do this. Or if he convinced himself to allow her to do it because he thinks that caring about what other people think makes him insecure. But it wouldn't make sense for the motivation to just be money because I'm assuming both of them are multimillionaires. And when I see that video and she's smiling before the scene, it doesn't exactly scream, I'm forcing myself to do this so I can I'm make saying? more money. You don't find Exactly. Exactly. Facts, man. Shout out to the to the man, to the poor man's podcast, man. Everything he said is spot on, bro. He said some real, real nigga stuff right there, man. I'ma go on in the video right here, man, and I'ma go and give my final takes on this whole situation. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to, to the Poor Man's Podcast, man. I'm going to leave his links down in the bottom of the description below, man, at the end of this video. So I'm going to end it like this here. 
no matter if you're in a relationship or not, there should always be boundaries in your life, man. Adam 22 and his wife Lena had boundaries that they they said they would not cross. You know what I'm saying? As adult entertainers, they made boundaries that they wouldn't cross. Those boundaries got crossed. Now, I don't care if he agreed to it or he let her went ahead and did it or whatever the case may be. The thing is this here, man. When you in the adult entertainment game, especially women, let me be frank. Women of lighter complexion. They make a little bit more money when they do scenes with somebody of a darker complexion. Just about. So, for her to do that scene, it was more than money. Because, again, Adam's 22 well off. He got money. This was something she probably been wanting to do. Even before she even met Adam 22. She just got the platform to make the money off it. She probably wanted something new. And again, he in the business where, and he in the business where you got to have something new. It got to be something new. You feel what I'm saying? No matter what, it got to be something new, something fresh. You know what I'm saying? For real, for real. So she wanted something new outside of, what she always was getting with Adam 22. Now, Adam 22 feel insecure about it. He feels some type of way about it, regardless if he want to agree to it or not agree to it. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to end the video with, uh, with Adam 22's statement on the situation. He made a statement about it. He finally responds. And it says right here on Twitter, it's officially been a week since I let my wife do a point since I let my wife do an adult scene with another guy. I felt a little jealous at first, but overall, it wasn't that big of a deal. She's watched me sleep with hundreds of girls, and it's never affected our relationship. So he say. Sleeping with that gentleman has been amazing for both her career and our business at Plug Talk Show. Overall, I'm glad we did it and I'm happy to report I'm happy to report her for JJ has returned to its original <laughs> This make me laugh every time I read it. I'm happy to report her for JJ has returned to its original pre British Columbia size. <laughs> And this is why Adam 22 is a straight up lame. So yeah, man, that's the video. I'm in the video like this, man. No matter if you're in a relationship or not, man, always have boundaries. Without those boundaries, you are doomed to fail. So yeah, man. Shout out to the Poor Man's Podcast for the video, man. I'm going to leave his link down in the description below. You know what I'm saying? Y'all new to the channel, show love to the page, man. Y'all keep y'all keep showing love to the channel, man. This your boy AJ signing off. Peace and one love.